Hello. Hi. 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 My name is Aruna. Hogundal. Meenal. Vaishnavi. Trainik. What is your field of interest? I want to get into automation. My interest is aerospace. I'll be testing the innovation. Me? A coder. Coding. Autonomous vehicle? Depends. Building robot. Artificial intelligence? I will build robot. We not only need to identify the fields of interest in young students, but also provide them with options which will please them in their mainstream professional career. The education that we deliver today determines and defines the future. This is especially relevant to the present generation where we must take them to the emerging technology and innovation. I think we are heading in the right direction when it comes to a technology for the future and beyond the cosmos. We are a generation which saw the evolution of innovation and technology slowly become a part of our life. I wonder what will be the next big thing waiting for us. Welcome to the future of learning at Amarajyoti Public School. We're building robots, exploring artificial intelligence and getting into the world of machine learning and coding are integrated part for students from grades 1 to 11. Amrajodi Public School has taken this initiative to bring robotics to our students not only in the view of students' career but also keeping in mind a big aspect, blending robotics to their regular curriculum. This actually helps the students to deal with the technology-filled future. It also empowers them to be get the full potential academically, professionally and personally. Amar Jyoti, in association with Joint Vortex, has mastered the robotics, artificial intelligence and machine learning, especially to deliver excellence to all its students, ensuring them a bright and strong future. Our journey begins with the spark to create interest for grades 1 to 3 where students explore small creative animations, visualize math, think and write, coding stories, understanding circuits, storyboards and designing robotic models. Ferris wheel is a ride consisting of an upright wheel with many passengers carrying a component in such a way that it makes the wheel rotate. We can find the giant wheels in exhibitions, fairs and many other places. Now I am going to explain the components present in the giant wheel. The components are base, controller, DC motor, color beams and bolts. Controller, round buckle, pulley, ball brake and flat hole and the cup. For a coding purpose, we are using the coding pen, coding cards and magnetic board. Controller, tooth gear, axle, slope bridge, hole bricks and motor. And we are using some color beams and green bolts and some communication wires. Now let's see how it works. Akshara, can you please explain this in detail? Sure. First I'll explain the components of the float board. Emotion screen, decorative part, angle beam, DC motor, axle, gear. Here we have another wheel called universal wheel. This helps us to turn 360 degrees. Yes, we start introducing robotics at a very early age for the grade 1. We as teachers encourage a child to ask how something works, dive into the explanation and relate it back to robotics whenever possible. Our curriculum ignites curiosity and innovation, preparing students for a future full of possibilities. Before we present our project, we extend our heartfelt appreciation to the ATL Lab for their invaluable support and state-of-the-art facilities. Their dedication enhances our learning experiences, fostering innovation. Thank you AJPS for your unwavering commitment. By grades 4 to 7, imagination fuels robotics. Students build and program robots by embracing teamwork, strategy and creativity. 
earphones camera and ai algorithms the blind stick can detect obstacles in real time navigating their surroundings with greater independence and safety so now i'll be showing you the working of this robot this robot will respond to hand gestures like move forward left right and stop So basically this robot enables the system to understand and respond to human hand gestures in real time making human robot interactions more initiated and natural As we can see this machine is called a 3D printer this machine helps us to print the 3D model we have done in Tinkercad this wire is called as a filament with the help of the filament we can print our 3D model In our ATR class, we learned about AI and other controllers, which help us to do in real-time projects. With that learning in class, by doing practicals, we got a handsome experience. The main part of our journey is coding, and we start as early as grade three, all the way to advanced level for grade eleven. It's about thinking differently. using python and block coding to unlock new possibilities in grade 8 to 11 we dive into artificial intelligence and machine learning students teach machines to learn and interact paving the way for a smarter future the components which we are used in this prototype are ultrasonic sensor jumper wires leds register Arduino board. Students teach machines to learn and interact. Years of learning empowers our students to initiate their own complex and long-term various robotic projects in many fields by the time they come to higher grades. So we transition into specialist mentorship roles, connecting them with many research and professional-based studies. We are the catalysts for inventors of tomorrow. Throughout all grade levels, it's important to foster a supportive and inclusive learning environment where students feel empowered to explore, experiment and create. From this, we successfully cultivate a lifelong passion for robotics and STEM education in young minds. We are building strength in every student by providing deep knowledge with strong foundation in cutting edge technology, a technology that never fails, a technology that has competitive edge over others and the technology that can drive us beyond the cosmos we are the future 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 hello i'm geeta somnathan principal of amar jyoti public school kiarpuram and at ajps we believe in holistic development we believe that each child is unique and our motto is learning beyond boundaries so a child learns beyond classroom we need to hone their skills so that they innovate they create and this can be done through experiential learning so that they contribute to a larger community and be empowered global citizens 